Hey guys, I'm John with Hops and Brews, and I brought my brother Steve over. Hey. Recently, we've been trying some pickle beers. Mm. Some good, some... Mm, nah. Not so good. <laughs> yeah, some weird flavors have been going some on. Some interesting stuff, some surprises. Some surprises, aroma bad, tastes good. Yeah, you never know. Yeah. But we found out that maybe the Imperial ones are a little bit better, the barrel-aged ones are, spicy yeah. ones are kind of probably a little too spicy. Yeah, that one was Interesting. Yeah. So let's see if we can combine the two with a barrel-aged tequila spicy pickle beer. Hi, Chihuahua. So today we're gonna to be checking out Martin House Brewing's best made tequila barrel-aged spicy pickle beer. God. It's a mouthful, right? I don't I want it. I, uh, I mean, I do like peppered beers, but I hate tequila. I hate pickles. I hate spicy pickles. See, I kind of like all those three. <laughs> uh, but given the history that we just had with these beers, I'm still a little leery. <laughs> Cautiously optimistic is what I'm going to call myself right now. It's, it's a flip of a coin on this uh, one. I, I think, think it's going to be, yeah. Let's uh, find out. Let's find out. This beer comes in at a 9.2% ABV, an 11 IBUs, don't know where that's coming from. It gets an average rating on untapped of 3.85. A tequila barrel aged spicy pickle beer aged four months in tequila barrels. All right, uh, it's it, it, green. It's, yeah, it kind of has the color of Mountain Dew, <laughs> almost. I think I was shocked, like pouring it, like, oh my yeah, God, it's I green. Know. Yeah, <laughs> this is this is like if I drank like a six pack of Mountain Dew and peed. This yes. is what it would look this like. This is exactly what it would look like. Yeah. Um, all right, let's see. I smell it. Whoa. <laughs> That is very pickly. That is that is extreme bad. pickle. Oh god! Now, if you like the smell of pickle, you would like the aroma. And I don't oh. hate the smell. No, that's. It doesn't smell like something I want to drink. That smells like much. something I want to eat. That is too too much for me. I don't like that. Yeah, my, I'm already getting ready to spit. <laughs> <laughs> You're salivating already. I'm already it's all, salivating. You're already it's so delicious. All, all right. right. <sighs> Whoa. No. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Okay. This is like they dumped all the last beers that we had all together when minus the tropical punch flavor. I don't like it. That is insane. Okay. I will state though, it's spicy. It is spicy. It's it's like Cayenne oh, pepper, red chili crap. flake this is, pepper. This is hot sauce. This is hot sauce. I would put this on a burrito. I don't want to drink this. Like this, I would put it on a taco. Like boil this down and make it like a mustard or something on yeah, a burger. I'd be all over that. But but no. No, not for a drink. Not for drinking this straight up. This aroma is horrible. Oh my god. This taste. I kind of do get the burniness and tequila. Like the, the spicy pickle reminded me of a really cheap tequila burn. I'm not even getting tequila. I'm just getting like spicy pickle. That is all I'm getting. <laughs> no, I don't like, there's a weird tingling. Like once I drink it, I don't like it. Again, I would like this if I was putting it on a food or something like that. Oh. As an accent, not as something <laughs> I just want to drink. It is, it is. <laughs> extreme oh god it is right in your face oh. punch you in the gut type of spicy pickly goodness god at least i got the lit like the fire bridge yeah that's all oh right. yeah that is that is accurate that is again accurate. this is the thing we've seen with all their beers they may not be what you like they may not be good 
but they are accurate. In they their are description. accurate in their. Description. They are accurate description. There's lots of beers we've had where they put so and so on the label, and you taste it like I taste none of that. Yep, and I do taste spicy. Everything, pickle, everything. Sure else. Yeah, I mean, I go with like the spiciness of it, kind of can either hide or complement a cheap tequila. This would probably go good with a Michelada. I hate both of them. I don't like Micheladas personally, uh, but uh, some people who love Micheladas, honestly, you took this with a good tomato juice, it would probably make an excellent Michelada if you're into it. I would think the sweet tomato would make this pretty good. Oh, God. But I am not into Micheladas. So I cannot say I don't that I like, love it, but. I, I, well, I hate tomato juice. I actually like tomato sauce. I hate tomato juice for some reason, isn't that weird? But uh, I just really hate pickles. And this is, <laughs> this is the, wow. I still think I hate the original the worst. Okay. This, at least the leftover on my tongue is spicy. Yeah. So I'm trying to trick my brain into saying, I'm, I'm, I just ate something with hot sauce. I do enjoy the back end. I do enjoy the lingering hotness. I think that flavor is actually pretty good. Yeah, that flavor I will give it. But props. yeah, it's it's like it's like after I ate a good taco with some good hot sauce. It's yeah. kind of what the flavor is getting after. But it's not something I want to drink really. I will say I do not taste the nine percent. That's true. It is a nine percent. <laughs> this is a nine percent spicy pickle nine beer. Nine point two percent. So yeah, uh, I don't taste man. that. So. That, I, I, there's another gold star I can put onto it. Although I guess it does kind of burn, it but does. In, in a different way. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to finish this. I, I think I even see like oils hanging on the top of the glass. Oh yeah, I think I see it too. Uh, That's probably why the head dissipated so Probably, quickly. yeah. Like a good oily saltiness <laughs> will coat the tongue and leave that salty residue in your, in your mouth. And that's probably why I kind of enjoy the aftertaste. I don't enjoy the initial taste, but the spicy kind of mellow aftertaste, I kind of like that. Yeah, there's not enough to make me want to finish it, but <laughs> good God. You know, like we said, with all of the Martin House beers, yeah. I think these are excellent to bring to bottle shares yeah. or to freak people out. Yeah. And you bring this to a bottle share or to show off to your friends, it's accurate. Yeah. This makes me want to go buy regular Martin House Beers. Just to see how, just to see how accurate they are with like IPA flavors, yeah, stout yeah, yeah. flavors. Yeah. Um, this is, I think, possibly could be a good solid gose. Yeah. Seems to be the base. I want to try other traditional sours of theirs, like a fruited sour. They really need to make like a Pepto flavored beer <laughs> with the amount of the spicy and pickly beers that they have after this. A Tums. A Tums. The hype, heartburn. A, a Tums festival <laughs> beer is what they need. <laughs> Yeah. So if you're looking for some heartburn and pickle flavor, yeah. Martin House Brewing's Tequila Barrel Aged Spicy Pickle Beer. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. See you guys. See ya. Mm. Mm -hmm.